Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Samantha Rizundu if you are new here and today we're talking about new makeup in Australia. Probably one of my favorite things to film because we get to talk about makeup and specifically makeup that is in Australia or accessible to Australians. So if it's international but easily and affordably, easily and of an affordable cost to Australians. So we look at websites like Priceline, Mecca Sephora, but then we also have a look at Trend Mood and try and predict what we think we're gonna get and when we're gonna get it, if it's gonna be this year or next year. So let's get right into it. I want to start with the usual Priceline. Um, I like to start with Drugstore. They just had a sale. I just bought some stuff. It was a good time. You know what I bought? I'm gonna tell you guys what I bought. I asked if you guys use Nude by Nature or Natio because I like never talk about it in my videos because I didn't think anyone used it and I was very naive. A lot of you guys use it so I felt really stupid and I'm going to start talking about it again and I just want to apologize for not talking about it. And I bought a product from New by Nature to try in a try new drugstore makeup video. Let's talk new. Oh, we've got some new things. Oh, how exciting. So I thought Bourgeois was out of Priceline because all their displays are gone out, but there are brand new products on the website. So maybe they're online only now. That could be possible. It doesn't say that. Like, you know how Mecca says online only? But tell me if I'm wrong, but all the bourgeois stalls are gone or going. Anyway, we have four, five, oh, we've got a few products. Oh, okay, that's what it is. There's a whole bunch of products on here. I think they're just online now, but they've been put in the new section because they're no longer in store. Because they've got the Healthy Mix Foundation here. Has that not always existed? Yeah, so I'm not gonna go through those things, but they're in the new section of Priceline. And that's where sometimes I get a bit confused because sometimes the new things are not new, but they may be being updated on their website. So it comes up as the new section. So sometimes I feel like I'm giving wrong information, but I'm happy for you guys to just call me out because sometimes I do make mistakes. I am only human. Max Factor has one product, the Radiant Lift Concealer. I don't really talk about Max Factor either and I feel like I need to not be biased because it is a mixture between Will I Buy It and Beauty News, but it is more so Beauty News. It's not just about what it is that I want and I need to be a little bit more inclusive of brands. I just didn't think anyone used Max Factor, but I could be wrong. An exclusive light diffusing formula is infused with nourishing vitamins and light reflecting ingredients for long lasting radiance. It sounds quite lovely, but I'm just not convinced of Max Factor. Oh, well, that's a bit exciting. I've got a real problem, guys. I've got a real serious problem I need to talk to you about. I have a very serious addiction to foundation and concealer. Every time I see a new one, oh my God, my son's awake. I just started the video and he's already awake. Pray for me. I got my daughter watching Toy Story for the first time. I was like, can we watch something new? I wanna introduce you to a new video. So she's watching that. I've got two kids, baby's awake. Let's see how long it takes before he gets annoyed at me. Anyway, I have a foundation addiction I wanna try it all. The NYX Professional Makeup. Bear with me, Tinted Skin Veil. Now there's only two dark shades here. So I'm guessing they haven't properly updated their website yet. Cause we've got two shades, Cinnamon Mahogany and Nutmeg Sienna. And I'm sure there's more shades than that, than two. And that concealer had one shade. So I reckon there's a bit of an issue with them not, they're putting the product on the website, but they're not putting the whole product range on the website. A lightweight tinted skin veil that helps to even out your natural skin tone and leave skin with a smooth satin finish. Infused with cucumber and aloe extract to keep skin hydrated for up to eight hours. Now, I don't know what the reviews are for this. All right, we're gonna have noise in the background. I do apologize. Um, I have not, I don't know much about this. Have you heard much about the reviews? Cause I know that this has been around for a while overseas. 
Satin finish sounds all right, actually. I don't mind a tint of moisturizer with that's not dewy because sometimes, like when I'm out on the run, I don't want to be like super dewy. I just want to look like me, but with an even skin tone. No. Um, so if you guys know anything about that, let me know. Maybelline, the Colossal Curl Bounce Waterproof Mascara. Currently half price for $12.47, so it's gonna be $25 normally. So this is described as big volume meets bouncy curl. Colossal Curl Bounce Mascara turns up the volume and curls up every lash without clumps. Up to 24 hours wear. I haven't heard anything about this either, but this reminds me of a security tag. Does this not remind you of a security tag? Am I reading too much into this? L'Oreal has a super liner liquid eyeliner for $12. This seems really cheap for, that's its price. And it only comes in brown, but I'm guessing it's probably black, but I don't have it on the website. Oh, 2.5 mils. Maybe it's really tiny. That's why it's cheap. Cause L'Oreal is not cheap. Ultimate long lasting liquid eyeliner with a sponge tipped pen for fine lines or thick sultry flicks. So sponge tip means like it's a felt tip, right? Maybelline have more range of their lifter gloss. I have never tried their lifter gloss, but I bought one from this new range and they're a bronzed collection. So they have their normal like tones that they had. Now this is a new collection of the lifter gloss called bronzed and there are four shades. So there are four bronze shades for different skin tones. I mean, you could wear any of them, but I think that's what it's designed for. So like I got the lightest one, Sun, which is this one. And I actually got it in store. I wanted to see what it looked like in store because the picture is not very accurate. Um, and I got it half price in the Priceline sale. So I got it for $9.47. And it looks really nice. It looks like a very summery kind of gloss. And I just really like the looks of it. And we also have new products from NYX. This is the, this is gloss. This is juice gloss. And I believe there are, oh my God, there's heaps. There's six colors. Um, I'm just going to, so there's a, oh, okay. So the clear one is coconut chill, watermelon sugar, that looks nice. Strawberry Flex, Guava Snap, Pomegranate Clout, and Passion Fruit Snatch. Okay, so that's $15.95. I was tempted to get this, but I was like, oh, I don't need this. And I got the other gloss, but I, you know what it is? It's the marketing that made me want to buy this. Not that I need a, a juicy gloss, because <laughs> they do look cute. Um, and I think their whole range, the whole thing is electrolytes. Uh, electrolyte infused color, drenched in shine, dripping in hydration, a range of juicy shades and juicy flavors. So the electrolytes they have is magnesium, PCA, zinc, PCA, magnesium, sodium, potassium, sorbate. Got rosa canina oil, grapeseed oil, jojoba seed oil, avocado oil, and squalane. And then the other two NYX products I wanted to talk about is the makeup setting spray that is plumping for $16.95 and the plump right back Plumping Serum and Primer 30, uh, for $29.95. I almost bought this primer because it was half price and I saw it at Priceline, but I was like, no, don't buy it. You don't need it. <laughs> and I just bought a primer for um, a future collab video that I'm doing. Um, so I'm just like, and I said previously in another video, I do not need any more primers. But why do I keep wanting to buy them? And I just don't understand. I need to finish my primers because I'm so glad I didn't buy it. I was like, no, stop it. And then there is another NYX product that I wanted to talk about is the Bear With Me Concealer Serum, $24.95. I got this one as well. It was out of stock online by the time I was wanted to buy it. And I didn't have it in my local price line, but then I went to a bigger price line and they had one left of my shade. I am so excited to try this. I have swatched it, but I haven't used it. I'm saving it for a video. I'm so excited because this has been in America for a while and I got it 50% off. It only just came out and I got it 50% off and I'm very, very proud of myself for getting that. Um, so very excited, very excited for video to come. I might do it for Wednesday. Yeah, I'm gonna do Wednesday. Also side note, if you are interested in any of my makeup, 
My earrings are these cute little safety pin looking ones from Ana Luisa. I have a discount code, which I never talk about. I'll have it all linked down below. But my eyeshadow palette is the Love Notes palette from Beauty Bay. It is such a good palette. I just, isn't this? Oh, I just, I can't. I, listen, we're not talking about this. We're not talking about it. It will be linked down below. Um, moving on, we have the L'Oreal Paris uh, Age Perfect Serum Foundation. Serum foundations and concealers, I'm very picky. I love the Costas concealer. So this is a lightweight firming foundation. Smooths your skin without leaving any marks. Smoothens lines and wrinkles without dulling your glow. Infused with collagen, AA fractions. It's clinically proven to firm skin over time and reduce the appearance of fine lines. I mean, it sounds good. I think the bottle looks pretty. Oh no, there are only six light shades. Hopefully that's a mistake. That's a bit embarrassing. And then we have the new Maybelline Superstay Active Wear Concealer. It's currently half price. I'm guessing all Maybelline is half price for $12, but originally $24. And online we have two, four, six, eight, ten 10 shades, which is still not much. It looks like there's one deep shade that doesn't even look that deep. And then like the rest are like medium tones. Oh, that's so not good. Tan is, mm. I just don't understand. These are like multi-million dollar businesses. Why can't they just extend the shade range? If indie brands can do it, why can't these massive companies do it? And if they do do it, why do they only do it online and not in store? or they only like bring to Australia certain shades, but in America, they've got all the shades. I'm sorry, but there are deeper skin tone people in Australia. Is this like a stereotype that everyone in Australia is white? I don't understand it. So then, sorry, I, if I seem a little bit jolted, I am in and out of caring for these children, <laughs> like every five seconds. So this might not be a very smooth video, but I'm trying my best, um, cause I, very much want this to come out on every second Monday. Like that's very important to me. So let's continue. Uh, the uh, Active Wear Concealer. Now I, their original Superstay Concealer, I hated. I ended up decluttering it. It was really dry and cakey. Um, I like a matte formula, don't get me wrong, but it was drying and it didn't look nice under the eyes. So this one, it delivers up to 30 hour wear. Wow. Full coverage matte. So it sounds like it's just a more long wear version of the old one. Wipes out dark circles and imperfections. I found the light shade was too yellow as well. It wasn't a good shade match for me. Comfort Curve Flex Applicator makes it easy to apply evenly. I saw someone review this and they did not like it. So it's kind of making me think it's gonna be just like the old one. All right, let's head over to Sephora. So milk, we have got the new milk uh, liquid cream, not liquid they're calling it, products. We have the Bionic Glow and the Bionic Liquid Bronzer. And I think that's pretty self-explanatory. I think one's a highlighter and one's a bronzer. We have the Overachievers Makeup Set, limited edition for $50, $49. And then we also have the Prep Swipe Go Makeup Set. So they're just two little mini sets and that one's $31, so a little bit cheaper. Estee Lauder have a new bronzer for $66. It's the Goddess Healthy Glow Bronzer, limited edition. Nude sticks have the Euphoric Nude Festival Face Palette Set, limited edition for $121. I did see on their Instagram that they collabed with an artist who um, this is their artwork on the front of the tin. Um, it looks like there's a highlighter and then eye, eye pencils and a lip gloss. That's what it looks like, it looks very pretty. I'm actually using their uh, magnetic, luminous magnetic eye color as a base for this shadow today. And then lastly, from what I can see, we have another milk product. It is the Rise Lifting and Ma Lengthening Mascara for $21, which is quite affordable, unless it's just the mini. Lauren May Beauty hated this mascara, <laughs> and if she hates it, I hate it. Okay, let's go to Mecca. Smashbox have re, uh, packaged all of their primers. 
I don't know if it's a new formula. Let's actually have a little read. It doesn't say if it's a new formula. I reckon they have <laughs> updated their packaging, but I don't actually know. So we have the control mattifying primer, the primerizer and hydrating primer. Yeah, they're just making all the packaging the same. The anti redness primer and the illuminate glow primer. So they have made the collection smaller and streamlined them to have all the same packaging. Bobby Brown has a corrector stick. I missed this last time. Children are very noisy. I don't know if you know that, but they're quite noisy. <laughs> uh, this comes in 12 shades for $54. Neutralizes discoloration. Now Bobby Brown's great at color correcting, so color correction at its most effortless. I like the sounds of this. I would prefer something like this over a pot. Because a pot, I don't know, I just like the idea of a stick more. Bright and dark circles. I wonder if it's, it's the same colors. Oh, it's the same colors. Light, bisque, peach. Oh, it's the same colors in a stick form. Oh, I'm actually quite interested in this. Oh, I'm quite interested. $54. Natural finish, medium coverage, buildable, but it's a color corrector, so you wear it under. Oh, I think I would like light bisque or bisque. Okay, um, Kylie Cosmetics Kai Brow Kit in six shades. So we've got a pencil and a brow gel. Mecca Cosmetica have a complexion perfection anti-redness primer for $40. Online only, there is a YSL mascara volume effect, effect? I don't know if that's a mistake. Um, Faux C01, $60. Lila B has a golden priming oil for $101. Goop, which I usually don't talk about because they're skincare, but they have a Goop Jeans Clean Nourishing Lip Balm Trio for $63. Oh, Bobby Brown. I just showed you the corrector stick. They also have a concealer stick. I'm just very impressed. I'm very impressed. You know, as I previously mentioned, I have an addiction to foundation and concealer. And I don't know why. Like I happily wear no makeup out. Like it's not like I'm someone that has to have coverage. But I just love, when is trying to communicate. I just love complexion. I love it. So this is natural finish, medium coverage, buildable, long wear, emollient rich formula. That's what I wanted to hear. 12 hours of crease proof true color. Well, now I just want to try bloody both of them. You know, I don't, I don't really have Bobbi Brown. I don't know what shade I'd be, but I don't really own Bobbi Brown. And I don't know why, because I want to try it more. Actually, I just got a foundation from work. I got the weightless foundation. What am I talking about? I sound so spoiled, don't I? Know. I am, I am spoiled. All right, that is Mecca. Okay, let's go to Abir Ebe. Gosh, I think my hair's gotten thicker now that I'm no longer postpartum. And I'm not complaining, but I've just, there's a lot going on. It's very hard for me to look seamless. Is that better? Beauty Bay. Makeup Revolution. We might get these at Priceline. I feel like this is the kind of product Priceline would bring. The Fast Base Contour Sticks. So there are four shades. One side is a concealer. The other side is a contour. They're currently on sale for $8.60, but they're $10.75. That's Australian dollars. It's all converted on Beauty Bay's website, uh, which is very affordable if you're interested in those kinds of products. And then there's also the contour and shadow crayon crayons. And what I like about these, I actually saw makeup, make me up Missa use these, and she contoured her nose with these and around her lips to give because when you contour around your lips, they make them look fuller because it's like a shadow effect. And she made that look really cool. And she actually preferred this product over the other, the fast base contour stick I just showed you. She felt like this was more blendable and emollient. Um, so it looks like one's for the eye and then one's for contouring. And I really like it. I hope this comes to Priceline. I think that'd be a cool product to have. Yeah, and I like her eye crayon. I'm so sorry. Muna, you're being very noisy. Okay, so there's also these face powder contour compacts for originally $9, but now $7.15. 
And let's click on it. Yes, she also used this, Make Me Up Missa. Uh, she does very different makeup to me. She does a lot more artistic, but she reviewed all of these contour products because she's a lover of makeup revolution and she did not like this. She got the shade light. Or did she get fair? No, she got light. No, she said she got medium. And she shouldn't have. She's like pretty much my skin tone and she bought the medium and it was far too deep and pigmented so she couldn't even um, use it. But she bought the shade medium which she probably shouldn't have. Um, there is fair, light, medium and deep. So it's a three shade contour and highlight palette. There you go. Interesting, they've been needing to come out with something that's a little bit unique because for such a com big company that pumps out products, there's gotta be some creativity and effort, I think. Um, and then we also have the lip contour kit. So they've really hit up all the kinds of contour. This one, and there are six different shades. It's originally 1075 and now it's 860. There are so many lovely shades actually. Let me show you this one. So they're for all different skin tones. I'm, I'm hoping you can assume that. Oh, it's a liquid lipstick with a creamy lip liner. There you go. I thought it was a lip gloss, but it's a liquid lip. Makeup Revolution have come out with Tanning Mousse. 32.25 and now it's 25.70 in three different. So we've got Ultra Dark, Dark and Light Medium. I am fake tan. I'm practicing for my holiday next week. Because I don't fake tan much, so I have to practice. And I bought the L Effect from Mecca, and I quite like it, but I'm still I'm still a novice. Novice, novice, novice. But I am tanned. I am tanned. Just saying. Let's go to... Before we go to Trend Mood, there is something new from Emco Beauty. They have a limited edition collection called Wild Beauty. And I went on their website and I couldn't see it. Could be me, not looking properly. I looked in the new section, I couldn't find it. But I'm gonna tell you what there is. This is available online on their website, Woolworths MBW. Yeah, so we've got some hair accessories. We've got three lip gloss pack. No, lip treatment three pack. Uh, we have, I'm sorry, it's really hard to see, a hair kit which has, it looks like a comb and it's got the magic wand that helps with flyaways which looks really good. And then we have the lip lacquer set which looks so cool. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight lip lacquers from clear to nude to pink to red. Um, so that looks like a really cool collection and currently Emco Beauty online is 25% off. They did just have a 40% off sale, which you know I hit up because I did that video that I will link here for you. But yeah, I think that's a really nice collection. And then we're going to go to Trend Mood. Okay, we have a new eyeliner from Benefit. They're real extreme precision liner. Waterproof liquid eyeliner. A 0.1 millimeter tapered brush tip draws thin and thick lines with different for different looks. Waterproof, smudge proof, and long wearing with satin finish in black and brown. Available now in Europe, but that is we are not Europe. Dior Addict Refillable Shine Lipstick delivers up to 24 hour hydration, up to six hours of radiant color. Refillable lipstick. What's with all these refillable lipsticks? Oh, I'm sorry. I ain't refilling nothing. I can barely finish one and then I'm onto a different brand. I'm not buying the same one. Although, yeah, no, pretty much not. Anyway, that might um, appeal to someone else, not me. I can't be so biased. There is a new collab with I Heart Revolution and Dr. Seuss. So it includes Cat in the Hat shadow palette, Green Eggs and Ham shadow palette, I do like Dr. Seuss, I'm not gonna lie. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, fish. <laughs> Eyeshadow palette. Oh, the places you'll go, shadow palette. Fox in socks, face palette. Oh, the place, okay. Oh, the places you'll go, lip gloss, lip gloss. Fox in socks, lip gloss. I'm getting tongue tied. Horton, here's a who lip gloss. Eye crayon collection, palette collection. Oh, you can buy the whole collection. One thing and two thing brush set. And 
Is that the face palette? Fox in Socks face palette. Okay, I'm gonna show you the face palette because I was wondering what that was. I thought they were trying to do like a unique design for eyeshadows, but it's not. These are two face palettes. It looks like one is a shimmery blush and one is a shimmery bronzer. I don't hate this collection. I don't need it, but I don't hate it. And I know I said I don't like gimmicky things, but there are always exceptions to the rule. I love the brushes. <clears throat> I love the brushes. They're so cute. And I do like Dr. Seuss. I bought some Dr. Seuss for Ivy. I think I want the brush. Thing one and thing two. I reckon this will come to Priceline because we've been getting, we've been getting them collabs. So that's pretty exciting. We have a new shade of the Gloss Bomb from Fenty, uh, cream, color, drip, lip cream, and bubble binge. I like it. I really like it. I've never tried the cream formula. I love the heat lip gloss. I have the original red one and I wear it all the time. I leave it in my bag. I wear it all the time, especially when I'm not wearing makeup. It just makes me look a little bit juicy and cute when I, um, thank you darling. When I, Ivy just brought me some mint. Should I eat it? Mmm, yummy, fresh. <gasps> What's that? Oh my God, I just got so distracted. But I love that lip gloss, is what I'm trying to say. So, and I really like this pink color. Oh my God. What? I thought this was Melt Makeup doing a round two of an eyeshadow palette collection. You know there, is it the Verde and Moete? I don't speak the Spanish, I'm really sorry. I know I butchered that, but you know the two palettes, the living and the dead one that they had? I thought they were doing round two because this packaging from Give Me Glow, which is an indie brand. I don't even know if we can easily access this brand. I've heard that their shadows are phenomenal, but they are totally ripping off someone else's idea. I'm sorry. This is called Two Moods. Bad mood versus good mood. Four quads in one. What do you mean four quads? Magnetic pans, so you can arrange these if you prefer, $64. Yeah, that's not, I'm not, I'm not impressed with that. Makeup by Mario, ultra suede, cozy lip creams, satin matte lip cream, comfortably cushions lips in one swipe. It's all about lip creams at the moment. I'm wearing a lip cream right now. In my opinion, it's the OG lip cream, the Australis Girl Boss lip creams, love them. Love them. I'm still not tempted by makeup by Mario. <gasps> the only thing I really want to try is their cream blush and bronzer. Mommy, okay, that's a magic lantern in the sky. Beautiful. Yes, that's a magic in the sky. It's a magic in the sky. Mm, you heard it here first, guys. In a, in a plane. In a plane, yeah. yeah. Uh, Colourpop have a limelight collection, including eyeshadow palette, three jelly much, and two colour sticks. This beautiful. I know by though, but this beautiful. I love this shade of green. Oh, I love lime green. Okay, this was on uh, Angel, Naked Angel, Angel Naked one, the Instagram page, which I believe she's Russian. And they've just been, as of today, I think booted out of uh, Instagram social media. So she left a link for the Telegram app. Oh. I haven't even spoken about it. I usually don't just because we come here for a place of entertainment and to escape from the seriousness and the harshness of the world. So I don't usually talk about these things, but I do want to acknowledge the people of Ukraine and you know, the people who are in Russia who are against this war. I, I, I don't, I don't have too much to say, but it is, quite devastating to watch on the news and it just reminds it reminds me of how lucky i am to be here in australia right now in this moment and we don't know what the future is do we um but yeah sorry her account i'll leave her account linked below because i'm sure if you want to still stay connected um you can connect with her telegram link that she had I think that's what a lot of Russians are doing is going over to Telegram who are on social media. But I do want to know that I'm intentionally keeping it lighthearted. I'm not trying to ignore what's going on. 
Um, I'm very much aware of what's going on. Doing my part to understand everything, but I do like to keep this as a place of light entertainment. So, and baby noises in the background, free of charge. You're welcome. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to acknowledge that. And yeah, that just triggered my memory. Cause when I'm in makeup mode, I'm in makeup mode. I'm not thinking about the seriousness of my life or the world, you know? My, no one's life is perfectly dainty and sunshine all the time, but I do like to bring that to my videos um, because that's what I like to see in YouTube videos when I'm watching it, it's just to relax. Just forget about the world for a second and just think about something superficial. So I'm here, that's what I'm here for, is to give you that light entertainment. So I hope I am achieving that. Okay, um, this was something that, I can never remember if it's Naked Angel or Angel Naked. <laughs> one of those she um, uh, showed this she does like trend mood but like releases before they've even released um, this was ages ago I feel like it was around Christmas time they we saw this and it's now available in Asia it's the it says Asia the highlight and contour palettes from Mac sculpt and glow um, so the duo includes extra dimension skin finish and double gleam and she tone blush in Omega the only issue I have with this is this is suitable for only one skin type. And MAC, they're not about that. They're very inclusive of skin tones. So I don't know why they have literally done one just for fair skin. So this is suitable for me. But even light skin, no, because this is a gray tone cool. This is a gray tone contour, which is for fair skin only. And I really want it. But I don't want to get it because of how exclusive they're being and I don't like it. Especially when they don't usually do that. I don't understand what they're doing. Chanel has the new illuminating powder in beige rose. This is my kind of highlighter. And I like that they say illuminator because it's probably not crazy highlight. It's more of like a nice natural glow. A luminous powder highlighter that imparts a rosy beige glow, Muna. Oh my God, he cannot stop. Um, embossed with a three-dimensional form of camellia. It includes the mini kabuki for 88. So that's going to be over a hundred Australian dollars. <laughs> but that doesn't take away from the fact that I want it. It's stunning looking. Um, Huda Beauty has new, brand new um, cream blushes. And you see the picture? Does this not look like Mecca Max? <laughs> Mecca Max was before their time. That's for sure. Um, these are the cheeky tints they're called cheeky tint blush stick 25 us dollars each and they come in five shades love the shade colors love them like love all of them i just think it hits fair light medium deep skin tones in five shades they've managed to do that those first two is what i want what is it perky peach and proud pink because i my mecca one looks like that peachy tone one i have sorbet those first two, that pink and that nude. I just don't need it, but I just want it. When is this available? Coming soon. That was four days ago though. I might pick one up. I might. I've got a Sephora voucher that I want to use, but I've been waiting for something to release that I really, really want. Ah, Moira Cosmetics, who I talk about all the time. I did a full face video that I'll link up there for you. They are um, an in I think it's an American indie brand, but Discount Beauty Boutique stocks pretty much all their products, which is an Australian retailer based in Brisbane. And really affordable, really, really good quality makeup. And they've come out with new Love Heat Cream blushes and these look incredible too. Good Lord, I've got a problem. I've got a problem. These videos don't help my problem either. So we've got, I respect you, I need you, I want you, I adore you, I love you, and I miss you. God damn. I've been wanting to get more of the Lucent Cream Shadows from Discount Beauty Boutique from Moira. Maybe I could pick up one of these too. Coconut oil and aloe vera extract leaves a dewy finish flush. Dewy flush finish, six shades. $8.50 each American. So it's going to be just over $10 to $12, depending on how much it costs to bring here. I missed a product from the Makeup Revolution. It is the Ultra Cream Bronzer in shades light, medium, dark, deep, and deep dark. 
Um, I missed that on Beauty Bay. I mustn't have gone deep enough into the website because sometimes it's a little bit jagged, but I did, I, d I do have a photo here of everything. So Nas, my baby, you know, I love Nas, but they're doing this again. We have the uh, um, Summer Unrated Blush Bronzer Duo. So Orgasm X, which is like a deeper coral and gold pearl and Casino. Oh, very good. They've done a deeper version and a, the regular Laguna Orgasm and then the Orgasm X Casino. Still not deep enough. Aha, and then they also have Dominate. Shimmering Deep Plum and Cypress Warm Deep Red Brown. Beautiful, love to see that. They've done three different shades. Not just the one, finally. This is what I don't understand, these brands that are so inclusive in so many different products, but then they bring out the same Laguna Orgasm products over and over and over again, which is for light skin only. They've finally brought out three duos with light, medium and deep skin tones. Finally, love that. And then this beautiful eyeshadow palette. Good Lord. Is it, is it limited? Yeah, everything's bloody limited edition with NARS. It drives me mental because I'm like, if I buy this, I can't use it on my channel because it's gone. Like their blush palette is one of my most favorite products in my whole makeup collection. You can't buy it anymore. It just drives me mad. Um, this is their summer collection, by the way. Um, and then the orgasm lip mask is that little product in the corner. Aha, uh -huh, Natasha Denona Pastel Palette. I'm just gonna quickly skim over this. I'm just not interested. Um, I do have a Pastel Palette from Morphe, and I, I, I honestly, I don't even use that that much, but I keep it because sometimes you want a pastel look, and I keep it for that. Um, it looks beautiful. Like, it really looks beautiful. If someone gave this to me, I'd absolutely take it, but I'm not gonna buy it. Danessa Myrix or Myrix has the Yummy Skin Collection Glow Serum and the Serum Foundation. This looks really beautiful too. Their um, Vision Cover, their full coverage foundation is fantastic. I had to give mine away because it was just completely the wrong shade, but it was so good. I am Mommy. quite interested in trying this. Uh, buildable medium coverage, 26 shades with four different undertones, pink, gold, neutral, and warm, hyaluronic acid and squalane, refillable packaging. Just looks beautiful. I'm kind of rushing because my children are done with me. They're like, give me attention. Um, Huda Beauty, I also really want to try this because it's the Cherry Blossom Collection. Easy bake, loose, loose baking and setting powder, $34. Suitable for fair to medium skin tones, neutralizes and brightens. And then there's also the lip set for $37, which is a liquid matte lipstick in Lucky Warm Bright Coal. Okay, and then there's an illuminating lip balm. Maybe I will get a couple of Huda products with my voucher when that does come out. Yeah, okay, that is everything. I think this is actually gonna be a really long video. It's going to be a mountain for me to edit because I have been interrupted every two seconds. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, that completes the video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Share it with your makeup friends. Get the word out. Leave a comment, let me know your thoughts on all the makeup we spoke about, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.